This uh, video is going to go over how to create a new project starting from scratch in Boost CV. To this, we're going to use IntelliJ, which is an IDE, and it's uh, my favorite one. Um, there's a free version available, although I'll be using the commercial one in this. They're very similar. So before you start, download and install IntelliJ. And then run IntelliJ and select Start New Project, create a new Gradle project, add Boost CV as dependency, create a new class and start programming. Um, you'll find examples on Boost CV's website to be very useful. The website is at http.org. Fantastic. Okay, let's get started. So first, let's open IntelliJ. Our guide open, go to File, New, Project, select Gradle, Java, and then you need to select an SDK, which is 8 or newer. Um, I'm using 11 because um, I'm trying to like use slightly more ver modern versions of Java. This project will open an image, so an appropriate name will be Open Image. Okay. What we need to do now is add um, Boost CV as a dependency. I don't know um, everything off the top of my head, so let's go to Boost CV's website. So, click on Download. And scroll down a little bit and then there will be here the great old dependency so let's select that go back to IntelliJ and then just paste it in here and then this popped up reload the Gradle project um, on your computer if it's the first time it might um, spin its wheels for a few minutes or seconds while it downloads the jars they aren't that big but you'll have a noticeable pause so Let's create a new class, go new, Java. I will call this class main. Now let's create a um, main function. Fantastic. Now what we want this to do is open up a dialog, let the user select an image, load the image, and then display the image in a window. Now, the first part we'll do is open a file, Boost has a built-in thing that will open up for you. Parent will be a parent component that um, helps it choose a appropriate location for the dialog. There isn't one, so it's going to be an inappropriate location. Um, default path. Sorry, open file. True to that. Default path, just wherever. And then we want to only open images. That's what I'm telling it to do now. It'll return null if the user cancels. Okay, convert it to an image. We're going to use buffered image, not one of the ones because it's easier to display in the window. But this would oftentimes be the first step even if we want to process the image. I recommend to use util image IO, which is part of Boost CV. Uh, it's features over the default image loading in Java. And then to show it, we'll use a Boost CV visualization tool called Show Windows or Show Images. Um, and then image, let's give it a title, example, and true. The last bit there means exit on close. It'll do just that. When you close the window, it'll exit the application. So let's run it. Open the dialog in the wrong window. Drag it over here. I've already um, selected or moved it to the correct location. And select bottle. And here we go. Here's my um, bottle. And uh, that's it for this uh, demonstration showed you how to create a new project in IntelliJ, add Boost CV as a Gradle dependency, load it, create a new class, and then um, launch Boost CV or call Boost CV functions.